Remote controlled helicopters, you'll soon be old news. Minnesota researchers have now made it possible to control the mini flyers with your thoughts. Mind control, people. Mind control. Place an electro sensor over the scalp of human subject, and we train the subject to ask them to imagine certain movement action with intention of control the flight. So the controller doesn't actually move at all. It's all in the head. They do say the human brain is a powerful place, but it all really comes down to two words, the force. But really, nature.com breaks down the inner workings. Specific neurons in the brain's motor cortex produce electric currents. These currents are detected by electrodes in an EEG cap, which sends the signals to the computer. The computer then translates the signals into a command like turn right and sends it to the robot via Wi-Fi. It then turns right. And in case you were wondering, this futuristic invention isn't hitting store shelves to become playthings for kids anytime soon. The mind-controlled copter was actually created for a much different purpose. According to the lead professor, this brain-computer interface technology is all about helping people with a disability or various neurodegenerative diseases to help them regain mobility, independence, and enhance performance. Now the question is, what else will we soon be able to control with our minds? Lunch, come to me! Well, one can dream. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.